New tonight, we're hearing for the first time from the new man charged with turning around the troubled Hillsborough County Animal Shelter. Uh, Bill Logan is live tonight with how Scott Tribotowski plans to do that. Bill? <laughs> And he is ready to get started and jump in here right away, Linda. He doesn't officially land on the county's payroll until March the 10th, but he showed up here at Animal Services on Falkenberg Road just to kind of get a feel for the place. A self-described dog lover who started his caring for canines and cats career as a pet sitter, the 50-year-old Trevitowski spent a little time with Otto, a golden retriever brought into the shelter last Friday. A hands-on reminder of just why he's here. Yeah, I'm looking to definitely get as many animals into good homes as we possibly can. Um, you know, every community is going to be a little different, so we'll have to kind of see how we're going to tailor the programs to this community. But I think there's a lot of good things that we can do uh, to make things better here. Especially in light of recent pet euthanasia mistakes and a shelter kill rate that's higher than anyone wants. The man who has worked in both Lee County and Jacksonville to control pet populations says he wants to knock down the number of pets put down. Euthanasia, both the way it's performed and making sure that the right animals is huge, huge, huge for me. I am also a state instructor in euthanasia, and I intend to be sure that, you know, we do scrutinize that area because it's... It's very important to not make errors. But on this day, when he still hasn't found his office, but did manage to find some time to spend with a kitten named Lola, he wants the animals and their owners to know he's here for them. So it's time for everybody to kind of work together, um, help me along the way, I'll help them along the way, and, and we'll make some big progress. Progress that a lot of folks are saying is a long time in coming. They're hoping that uh, Scott can turn things around here very quickly. But as one person put it, who is the head of the local Humane Society, and I'm quoting now, if cats could talk, they'd be very happy. So some good things happening here, seemingly, uh, at the Animal Services Operations Building. We're live in Hillsborough County tonight. Bill Logan, ABC Action News.